First, we will add 7 grams of dried yeast in 325 milliliters of warm water and half a teaspoon of sugar. We mix it well and leave it for 10 minutes or until it starts reacting and forming bubbles. In a bowl, we'll add 500 grams of type 00 flour, a glug of olive oil and around 5 grams of salt and mix it well. After shaky dough forms, we'll start kneading it by hand until the dough becomes smooth and soft to the touch but it doesn't stick to the table. In a big pan, we need to stretch the dough out and poke it with fingers to form little wells that will capture the oil and make the bread crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. Then we drizzle it around with around 60 or 80 milliliters of olive oil and, sp and spread it around. After you finished, you can start adding the toppings you like, anything goes. But I found out that some of the best combinations are walnuts and gorgonzola cheese, sherry tomatoes with basil or spinach leaves, or garlic with parmigiano reggiano. With everything assembled, we can let the focaccia rest for 25 minutes under a damp kitchen towel. In the meantime, we can preheat the oven at 200C, where the focaccia will stay for 25 minutes. When you get it out of the oven, immediately drizzle it with olive oil, this way it gets even more fluffy and flavorful. Cut it in squares with some kitchen scissors and enjoy!